How you doing? I got some new lights in my brush guard. Uh, some Wheelan T, uh, excuse me, Wheelan M4s. In red, they got synced up to the microns. But it fits with the light bar a lot better. They're pretty bright like the light bar is, unlike the TIR3s I had in there. I'll turn those on for a comparison here in a minute. I still need to hook up the TIR3s in the back by the rear red marker light. There's no real comparison in optics. I'm not down in the TIR3, especially the economy one. It's a great light for the money, but you just don't get that output out of that small light. Or nearly as good off axis. Also got a new light bar and some modules in that light, uh, new light bar. I'll do a video here on that in a minute. But I've had these M4s on forever, and I don't know how I've made it so long without a linear light head, warning light. You know, they're really good up close. They're not as great from distance, but damn, these things are badass. They have tons of good patterns, a lot of stupid, useless pinwheel patterns that are dog shit, unless you plan on just like putting it on an ATV or a golf cart for like in crowds and shit for anything 50 feet in the end the pinwheel patterns are great other than that they're total horse shit they also have a dim mode and uh it's really happy and for the price I got these for 110 bucks a piece that's not terrible if you think about how long they'll last they should last at least six to five years five to six years excuse me but thanks for watching. Have a great day.